So basically, if you're doing Airbnb in a metro area, you better have multiple exit strategies. Um, so luckily for this property, we've got close to 200000 in equity in it. So we can sell and and still make a nice profit when we sell. Good for you. Uh, Is that 200000 include what you have in it, like money you actually have in? Like um. Yeah, I mean that's so you're, thing. You're yeah. in a better spot than yeah. us. We're yeah. we're not. In, I mean, we have equity because, but we put that equity in as far as our down payment. You know, so. furnishings like furnishing it. Yeah, I mean, they're. I mean, I, you probably spent north of twenty grand, twenty to twenty five. Yeah, furnishing yeah. a big house like that. We were talking about. I was like, what do we do with all the crap that you know? And it's nice stuff. Yeah, couches and TVs and beds and bedding and washer and dryer. I mean, there's. It's not full house. And this shit, you know, like you have so much, like what do you do with all this shit, yeah. right? I mean, right. I don't want to put it on Craigslist and hustle it. You know, that's that's the last thing I want to do. So it's like, okay, if, our, if selling it's the extra strategy, um, what do we do with everything? Yeah. And I think a lot of, a lot of Airbnb owners, because this is a tax year assessment, right? So they're all going to get their bills this year. And I think they're all going to have the same, solution is we got to sell it because it's not profitable. They just took every dollar of profit away from us. So good business opportunity to, to go in and buy all the stuff that's sitting there. 